YouTube is one of the most popular video streaming platforms that a lot of people visit as it contains various content ranging from entertainment to tutorials. Accessing the site is quite easy as you only have to use your browser to do it. Sometimes though there are issues that can occur when trying to access YouTube. When trying to play a YouTube video and you might encounter this message an error occurred. Please try again later. Playback ID. This error message is caused by several factors. In this short video, I will teach you how to fix YouTube an error occurred playback ID error issue. You can access YouTube using different browsers such as Google Chrome, Microsoft Edge, Mozilla Firefox and or Safari. Either of these browsers, it is recommended to clear the cache and data of your browser to fix this problem as sometimes a corrupt data is what's causing the problem. In here, I will only be showing you how to clear cache and data on Google Chrome. If you want to know how to do that in other browsers mentioned, you can check on the article link provided on the description of this video. First, open Google Chrome. Then, click on the three vertical dots located at the upper right-hand corner of the screen. At the drop-down menu, click on More Tools, then click on Clear Browsing Data. In here, there is a time range option. You can choose between those options according to when you started to experience the problem, or if you want to delete everything to be sure, you can select All Time. Next, make sure the boxes for cookies and other site data as well as cached images and files are both checked. Then, click on Clear Data. After clearing cache and data of your browser, check if YouTube Playback ID error still occurs. If the first method did not seem to help fix playback error, you can try to restart your modem or router. Another factor that can cause this issue is when your computer does not have any internet connectivity. Try to open another browser tab then visit any website. If you can't open the website then you can try to reboot your modem to fix the problem. Just turn the device off and wait for a minute before turning it back on. Now, check if the YouTube and error occurred playback ID error issue still occurs. Next, flush the DNS cache. A DNS cache is a database stored in your computer which contains information on all of the websites you visited. This cache can sometimes become corrupted resulting in you not able to access a website. If this is what's causing the problem, you will have to flush the DNS cache. First, press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open up Run dialog box. Then at the Run dialog box, type CMD and press Enter or click on OK to open command prompt. If prompted by the UAC user account control, click Yes to grant administrative privileges. At elevated command prompt, type the following command, ipconfig, flush DNS and press enter to flush your DNS cache. After you have successfully flushed the DNS resolver cache, check if the YouTube and error occurred playback ID error issue still occurs. Your ISP will typically set your DNS to one which they have chosen. Sometimes changing this to Google's public DNS will fix this problem. First, press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open up Run dialog box. Then at the Run dialog box, type ncpa.cpl and press Enter or click on OK to open up the Network Connections window. Then at the Network Connections section, select the connection that you want to configure the Google public DNS for. Inside the Wi-Fi, Ethernet Properties screen, go to the Networking tab and go to the Settings box under this connection uses the following items. Then select Internet Protocol version 4 TCP IPv4 and click the Properties button. Inside the Internet Protocol version 4 TCP IPv4 Properties screen, go to the General tab. Select the toggle associated with use the following DNS server address and replace the preferred DNS server and the alternate DNS server with the following values.
click on OK. Next, click on Internet Protocol version 6 TCP IPv6 and click the properties. Inside the Internet Protocol version 4 TCP IPv4 properties screen, select General tab. Select the toggle associated with use the following DNS server address and replace the preferred DNS server and the alternate DNS server but this time, use these values for the preferred DNS server and the alternate DNS server. Click on OK. Next, restart your computer. After restarting computer, check if the YouTube and error occurred playback ID error issue still occurs. There's a possibility that your browser has some corrupt files which is causing this problem. To fix this you will need to download and install a fresh version of your browser. To do this, first, press Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open up Run dialog box. Then, at the Run dialog box, type appwiz.cpl and press Enter or click on OK to open Programs and Features section. Then, scroll down through the list of programs to locate the browser you are using that is causing error. Right-click on that browser and click on Install. Follow the on-screen prompts to remove the browser from your computer. Once your browser has been uninstalled, restart your computer. When the computer starts use the built-in browser either an Internet Explorer or Microsoft Edge to navigate to the download page of the third-party browser that you previously uninstalled and download the installation executable. Follow the on-screen prompts to reinstall the browser. Check if the YouTube and error occurred playback ID error issue still occurs after uninstalling and reinstalling new browser. After following the troubleshooting methods in this video, you have successfully fixed YouTube and error occurred playback ID error issue. We hope that this guide has been helpful. Please support us by clicking like, share, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more troubleshooting videos.